is. The game was rigged from the start. I was, um, exploring the Mojave Outpost over on Twitch with Atlas and the chat. Keep me company. But today, I'm kind of flying solo. And originally, I was going to do everything on stream, but I got to thinking. It's okay. It's okay to do things my way. Do things a little bit differently, right? Because the stream should always be looking towards the future. But for me, it's okay to take care and tie up things in my past. And that's what we're doing today. I'm done being nice. If you don't hand Ringo over soon, I'm going to get my friends and we're burning this town to the ground. Got it. We'll keep that in mind. Now, if you're not gonna buy something, get out. What the hell is your problem? I'll deal with him later. Well, you've been causing quite a stir. Glad I finally got to meet you. Welcome to the Prospector Saloon. They overheard your argument. How's uh Looks like our little town got itself on? dragged into the middle of something we don't want anything to do with. About a week ago, this trader, Ringo, comes into town. Survivor of an attack, he says. Bad men after him. Needs a place to hide. All right. We figured he was just in shock. So we gave him a place to lie low. We didn't actually expect anyone to come after him. It's odd that Cobb wasn't able to find Ringo. It sounds not that big. Uh, where is he? He's holed up at the abandoned gas station up the hill. Uh, what are you gonna do? Some of the others, like Sonny, will probably stand up for Ringo if he asks for help, which he hasn't. Personally, I hope he sneaks out of town one night and takes the powder gangers with him. Powder gangers? Chain gangs, really. The NCR brought them in from California. I already know a whole lines. lot about the powder gangers. Problem We've is, it turns out that giving convicts a, a bunch of, of dynamite and blasting powder isn't the best idea. It was a big escape not too long ago. Some of them stuck together so they could make trouble. That's what we're dealing with now. All right. Um. I think that's it. Be careful out there. Unfortunately, I already have a bad reputation with the powder gangers. But I want to ask Trudy. I wanted to ask Trudy. That crate is moving. Now, I admit I might have had a little bit to drink before I started, but, uh... Not enough for that to, to fool me. Anywho. I don't really want to get people of Good Springs mad at me. Doc Mitchell is a doctor who's really good and he's on the cheap. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to go talk to Ringo. We're going to see if we can figure out how to get him out of this mess. If I didn't already have bad blood with the Powder Gangers, I might play this a little bit differently, but... That's close enough. Who are you? Oh. What do you want with me? Hold up, buddy. I'm on the business end of that. Sorry about the gun. You just caught me off guard, that's all. We got off to a bad out. start. What say we start over with a friendly game of Caravan? You know how to play? Nah. I think Joe, Joe Cobb yeah. is after you. He doesn't look very tough, though. I hear he's afraid I'll shoot him down from one of the windows when I see him. And he's right. I'll have a much bigger problem once his friends show up. There's no way I could handle all of them in a gunfight. 
So what's the plan, huh? I'm gonna lay low for as long as I can, assuming the town doesn't throw me to the wolves. I've got no chance against the gang on my own. Maybe I can help. We just end up sharing the same grave if it's just the two of us. Now, if some of the other people in town were also on board... I'm curious, do you have anything to offer the townspeople for helping you? Start with Sunny Smiles. She's been friendlier than most around here. What does that mean? You sleeping with Sunny? Let's see what we can get out of here. Like that. Food. One thing about it, living in the Mojave. Gotta keep a good supply on food and water. Medicine too, if you can. Technically none of this stuff is his, so I'm helping myself. I'm all good stuff. Not exactly planning on getting poisoned anytime soon, but in case something happens. I've already had run-ins with the Powder Gangers, the Legion, the NCR. Hell, I've even fought with the Jackals. Set up an ambush next to an old busted gas station or something. I won. Ideally, I would just cap <clears throat> Joe Cobb and be done with it, but I might be asking for uh, a little much. Sunny! Prim wimped out and accepted NCR rule. Some people will do anything to feel safe. Huh, not a fan of the NCR. Hi there. Sticking around Good Springs for a while longer? Hey, yeah, listen, I gotta talk to you about Ringo. Uh, I might need your help. Say no more. I'm in. Just like that? Just like that. I have a feeling that I'm going to end up fighting those guys one way or another. So I might as well get it over with. Joe Cobb talks about leaving us alone if we hand over Ringo. But I know his type. He and his friends will come after the town eventually. However, between you, me, and Ringo, we aren't exactly a force to be reckoned with. A lot of people around here look up to Trudy. Mm -hmm. If you could convince Trudy to join us, some of the folks in town might decide to help out as well. I know Easy Pete's got a stock of dynamite somewhere, and Chet just got a shipment of leather armor we could borrow. Talk to them as well. Gotcha. Finally, there's a good chance we'll all end up with extra holes in us. So if Doc Mitchell could cough up some extra stim packs, that'd be great. I'm trying to get it all done. I'll be waiting. I have a good rep with uh, Doc Mitchell, so we'll start with him, yeah? I hope this Ringo guy doesn't have some extra dirt on him that I'm not aware of. Like he's not some ex-legionnaire or something like that. It would really put a damper on what we're doing right now, but whatever. I'm not going to worry about it too much for now. If he turns out to be sour, seems like just put a bullet in him go, like the rest. It's always the same. Folks just never leave each other alone. Sorry, pal. Hey, that's all you we need. Thanks, Doc. That was easy. Next. Now, I don't really know too much about Easy P. Um, other than the fact that he might have come from that mining operation that got outrun by Deathclaws, maybe? There he is, right there. Hey, Easy Pete. Howdy. What can Easy Pete do for you? Hmm. Why are you called Easy Pete? Was a prospector until I decided to settle here to get away from the NCR. Now we'll just take it easy and <laughs> help out with the Brahmin and Bighorners. You know about Joe. Bad trouble. Welcome. Um, start with the NCR. Don't get me wrong. The NCR's got a lot of decent folk in it. It's I just put them in charge of Prem, and that might not have been the best. 
Towns like Good Springs and Prim don't stay independent Shit. for long. Not if you've got something the NCR wants. Still, the NCR keeps the Legion away. Um. So. I don't have enough information on explosives by just a tiny, teensy little bit. I, I want, I want everybody's help on this if I can. I got a plan. Who knows? Maybe if I attack his reinforcements at the source, their raid on Good Springs won't be so bad. Yeah. Aha. Nice and easy. came from don't much care I don't feel too bad stealing from you know convicts gotta be careful though because I know that I'm walking into an ambush There's gonna be a problem. Yes. Even though I know I won't hit, I still take the shots. Oh, he came down. This armor is really good. I think I've got enough. Ten million. Nice. Did I get him? No, I didn't get him. Is that him right there? He's hurt real bad though. We got this, we got this. What was that? You like that? God, no. Technically speaking, I'm doing the NCR a huge favor by clearing this place out, but none of them need to know that. At least until I've shaken them down for a, a reward. 
But I'll cross that bridge when I come to it. Admin's office. got a little crazy there for a second, but we're okay. Take some drinks of water, some food, and take a step. Oh my. That's a machine gun. I might be in trouble here. folks. Managed to survive, I'll have gotten exactly what I needed out of this. Home stretch. <laughs> we did it. The Brotherhood of Steel would have had a fit to see them using energy weapons. Now there might be some stragglers in here, so I should be careful. Replaced everything that we lost. The warden's terminal. Guard transfers to the east. Comments on Caesar's reasons. Draft complaint to NCR command. And just like that, we leave as easily as we came.
I think there's still one more building to clear out, but I think that's a pretty big bulk of the Powder Ganger threat. I'm not itching to push my luck here. Pete? Let's talk, yeah? Howdy. Listen, we really need these explosives. Told you before, it's too dangerous for a bunch of amateurs to handle. I'm familiar with the handling of explosives. Uh-huh. Guess you know what you're doing. I'll go dig it up and get it ready. You'll have it by the time the fighting starts. Thanks, Pete. Yup. Alright. I'm gonna handle Chet last, if possible. Trudy. So you're planning on taking on Joe Cobb's gang. It's a big risk, but I suppose you have to do what you think is right. Hmm. Let me think about it a little bit more and get back to her. All right, you. You looking to buy some supplies? I need supplies to fight the Powder Gangers, and I want your help. Now just hold on. I never voted to take on the Powder Gangers. That's a thousand cap investment you're talking about. Right. I should just shoot you right now. Scumbag. But you know what? I think we can still make this I'm gonna head to this outpost here and see if there's somebody else that I can tell about uh, what happened. Coming from the north? Must be crazy to brave those roads. The Legion attack nipped and burned and killed everyone. What? There's no way. We're miles from the Colorado. They... They aren't even waiting for the dam to fall. They're already inside the borders. Mm -hmm. We'll never stop them. Not at this rate. We're doomed. Nuclear winter. Jackson. Looks like we got a new visitor in the old Brahmin pen. Not many people come. And if you're passing through, you... anything I can do to help? Help? No, look, I appreciate. Uh, you know what? Yes, I could use the help. And you look like you can handle yourself. I need to get the caravans moving again. That means clearing a path north. There's too much crawling the asphalt up the road to allow it. Sure. Thanks. I appreciate it. Come back here when you're done. You find it in your heart. Clear the road out north. I can do that. In fact, I kind of already have. Shouldn't be too much out here to find. I didn't think that the more jack would show up here. Slow. They aren't even what I came here for. Not gonna catch me bringing a knife to a gunfight. This is the road. I don't know. starting the jam. Move to a new 
position. Not like me to be so clumsy. Ooh. All right, now where are those last two? Jackals have been cleared and the ants as well. I think that'll be enough to please Jackson. Oh. Let's appreciate sneak up on the help. Like Wish I had more work for you, but nothing else on the radar at the moment. No, I mentioned, mentioned you might reward. accidentally get supplied, and I meant it. Not allowed to contract mercenaries at the outpost. Still, a requisition form or two can get lost, and they're not gonna come check. So here you go. Just between us. Service rifle. Actually, I do appreciate that. Ooh, and the ammunition to use it. Lunches. Alright, I'll take all of that. And some caps. I paid pretty well. I might not have intended for it, but I've got a good reputation with the NCR now. Let's go handle the powder gangers once and for all. Where is everybody? Howdy. Trudy. I was planning on sitting this one out, but for some reason, I can't help but like you. I'm with you. <laughs> Let have me have a word with a few other folks, and I'll see if I can't round up some more members for this militia you're creating. While everyone does own a gun, we could stand to be a little better equipped. The general store probably has what we need in stock. Be careful out there. Now I can use this last one in order to convince Chet to stop being a douche canoe. Alright, Chet. You looking to buy some supplies? Listen, we need supplies. This again? Like? Let them take over the town and I'm sure your business will be much better off, buddy. You made your point. I can provide people with some leather armor and extra ammo. Sure hope it's worth it. And uh, I'll be guarding the store while all this is going on. I have to put my business first. You understand. Chicken shit. I hate shit. Take it easy now. I'll be back to rob you blind later. All right, all the people in Good Springs are coming together to repel the Powder Gangers. Ringo, get up. Time for action. So what's going on? Did Sonny agree to help us? Sonny's with well, us. Well, I guess that means we're ready to go. Unless you think there's something else you can do. Let's do this. All right, I'm ready. I hope. Time to look alive. The Powder Gangers are here to play. How many? At least six. Joe Cobb included. They look pretty mean. Alright, let's go. Oh, Easy Pete came through with the dynamite. 
Here's your supply. I really hope I don't blow myself up. I'll be set up near the store. Let's hope that the gang doesn't manage to make it that far. All right. Let's go fight. I don't intend to do this clean either. Matter of fact, put on my strongest weapon. 21 down. 13 down. Oh yeah, by a lot. 25 shots, more than enough to kill a, a squad that moves, right? Especially when I'm hopped up on Psycho. Let's go. you a huge favor for this here these are technically crimson caravan funds but i know they'll understand once i explain things you're welcome i'll stick around for a bit longer but i'll be gone in a few days if you ever visit new vegas look me up at the crimson caravan camp good stuff all right everybody that's enough adventures in the wasteland I'm gonna pick up uh, a few things off of these bodies and go kick my feet up over at Doc Mitchell's house. See where I land up next, and I'll see you guys later.